Hello, I'm at the church of South Runcton in Norfolk. It's the latest church to join the portfolio of the Friends of Friendless Churches. And you're seeing it before work is starting to conserve it and repair it. I'd like to take you to the Chancel to introduce you to one tiny aspect of English church history. At the Reformation, stone altars were declared illegal in our churches and were replaced by holy tables. These had to be of wood and were movable. But did you realise that until the 19th century, it was illegal to place anything on them? This caused a little bit of a problem because in the late 19th century, the Oxford movement wanted a cross and candlesticks to be placed on the altar. And a few clergymen were actually imprisoned for placing them there. So to get round this, the good holy table was given this, a grading. It's a sort of shelf that stands on the back of it, onto which the cross and candlesticks could be placed thereby circumventing the law. You could also get a shelf built into the wall behind for exactly the same purpose. Today, we tend to forget the minutiae of 19th century church history. But I think here at South Rumpton, it's one of many features that help us understand the transition that created this wonderful building. 